What's up, guys? Hope everybody's doing well and having a great day. Pretty amazing the stir that this eclipse is causing. We've already seen a state of emergency in Texas. I think there are multiple counties that have declared states of emergencies. Now we're seeing even more schools close. We are into the hundreds now in multiple states. Texas, Arkansas, Indiana, Ohio, New York, Maine, all of these states and probably more in the coming days before the eclipse have closed multiple schools in multiple counties. Article over here at Newsweek.com goes on to say hundreds of schools are set to close over safety fears during the solar eclipse next month, which will plunge several states into darkness. The moon will appear to cover the entire surface of the sun during the early afternoon of Monday, April 8th. The path of totality will begin down here in Mexico, eventually making its way all the way up to Newfoundland. In this animation here, you can see the dark shadow that's going to be cast on the Earth, and right there it's going to be over the, the central United States, and that's where the majority of the schools are going to be closed, the east central United States in the path of the total solar eclipse. I've never seen anything like it. Article goes on to say, however, amid all the excitement, there are fears that the eclipse could prove dangerous as the day suddenly plummets into darkness. And here's a quick list of all the states and all of the closures. As we know, there's been several counties in the state of Texas declare a state of emergency ahead of the eclipse. Going from Texas to Indiana, they haven't declared a state of emergency in Indiana, but look at the long list of school closings in Indiana on April the 8th. Moving up into Ohio, same situation. Many schools in northern Ohio also set for closure. During the eclipse, the entire day, actually, April 8th. Look at the list here, how long it is. Unbelievable. And it continues on. Moving from Ohio to New York, dozens of schools across central and western New York, which are directly in the path of totality. Pennsylvania, looking at the following school districts here, closing. Vermont, long list in Vermont. And going from Vermont up to Maine, school districts in Franklin, Grand Isle, and Chittenden counties will close schools for the full day of April 8th's total eclipse. The eclipse is going to be joined by a comet that's inbound. It looks something like this right now. The tail could be even longer and probably will be. Comets have a natural tendency to start getting hyperactive the closer they get to the sun. The tails will grow exponentially. The head will get brighter like this comet here back in 2007. That was an unbelievable view of Comet McNaught. Will we see something like that with this comet here? 12 P. Pons Brooks? We'll have to wait and see. That was a view from the SOHO Lasco C3 instrument. Once again, state of emergencies and more schools set to close during the total eclipse. Thanks for watching. Have a super day and be safe out there.